I'm gonna do, I guess a mook, what is it got? Mukbang, mukbang. Yeah, so once some of our members uh, said they wanted to see us eat some Tanzanian food. So this is for the weightlifting geek, for Tay Eats, official Jamia, um, um, praying couple, praying Prayin couple, couple. They do some, yeah. Yeah, chime in, baby. Uh, my lovely cameraman, Mr. African Jim, is back there filming me. Hey, y'all. <laughs> so, uh, and everybody that do the, 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 the mukbang. Yeah, the mukbang people. Yeah, so this is just some street food here. We got some mishkaki, which is beef. And we got some salad -y, which is carrots and cucumber. We got some chips here. So, yeah, so I'm going to eat this up. I got some tomato, tomato sauce here for my chips and everything. I'm just going to pull that on there. How y'all doing today? Like we don't we don't do muck bangs, but um now nah, we doing this for y'all. We, <laughs> we doing this for y'all. So it's like in a mook bank, do y'all have to, you do you eat the whole thing? Most of them do. They eat the whole thing? Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't know if that's gonna happen. No problem. Boy, Tay eats. Got a hold of something else hot. I t I just yep. you know I knew <laughs> after that one chip challenge, I said it ain't no way. Tay eat gonna ever eat eat my hot Cheeto again? <laughs> Wrong. Wrong. You did. Wrong. She did. And sis, that chicken look good. I know. She said she cooked out. it herself. Mm -hmm. I see you, Tay. She tried to perfect and look good. And then burnt her soul out. <laughs> <laughs> that girl burnt her soul out herself. Y'all check out Tay E's video. Yeah. The last, I think it's two times atomic hot something. something. So it look hot. It looked hot. Yeah. I mean, she squeezed some extra on her. Yeah. I was like, man. Girl. Oh, you know who else we can't leave out real quick, baby? Sorry. Yeah. Uh, Yaya's, by, uh, Yaya's, Yaya's Best, best Life. life. That's her right. and Tim That's over right. there. Yep. All, all the mook bangers, you know. So this is usually how, you know, the tans eat, they eat with their fingers. My hands are clean, y'all. Mm-hmm. We wash, honey. We wash. So just get a whole, just some of everything. You know what I'm saying? Mm -mm. No, that's see that now you buck banging for real. That's how that muck bang be doing. They be slurping and fodding and not just, fodding. Girl, they be getting after it. That's how you muck bang for real. For real. And it's really good. You know, you add it's fresh, everything's fresh. Yep. Like literally this stuff is yeah. It's this morning. It dudes over across the way peeling up uh folks standing yeah, cutting potatoes. That, this is my contribution to the to the muck bang right now. <laughs> Yeah, and the salad has, and there's different kind of salads that make. This one has cucumber, bell pepper, mm -hmm. carrots. Sometimes it has uh, tomatoes in it. Mm hmm. It's really good, y'all. Yeah. Let me try to eat as much as I can. Well, I'm gonna get in there and help you, baby. Come on, baby. Get on the hill. Let's see how. Yeah, you just get your whole, get some get of you, everything. Get a little bit of everything. Yeah. Like that. Mm-hmm. And then you get it, and then you put it in your mouth. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yep. Again, beef, or they call it mishkaki. Mm-hmm. Crack Leo, mishkaki. Niki Swahili. Niki Swahili. Craft Leo be over there cooking, girl. Yes, you do. Well, her camera set up. Mm hmm. Got the uh, bird's eye and the. I see you, Craft. Right? That, I'm still on that pound cake. That girl made a pound cake for breakfast. It was so beautiful. I wanted to eat some of it. Yeah, well. If I was there, Crafty, I would have got me a piece or two. Or over three. there, uh, baking like somebody, Big Mama. <laughs> Baby, put some more uh, tomato sauce right here. Please and thank you kindly. And they just pile it on top. But if you eat, I mean, this was takeaway, y'all. So I feel like oh. this. But if you stay there, oh, if you eat, eat there, if you get a plate, man, yeah. it's like, like it's it's heaping. One plate, like real real talk, uh, uh, square up three, four people. Right. And again with the mishkaki, they put they put these on sticks on um shish kebab skewers skewers yeah. yeah. And I think all together this was like five skiers in one. Mm, yeah. Yeah. 
it usually go like three or four on. It's usually three or five mm -hmm. per skewer. Mm -hmm. So, and a skewer of three cost uh, me a tonneau. A mere tonneau in uh, USD as US dollar is about. It's 500 maybe, to shillings, me a tonneau. 500 yeah. to shillings. And, and US dollar. Uh, well, it's five hundred. Um, like it's yeah, it's into shilling, but mm -hmm. it's the oh, change version. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Thank you, baby. Yeah. Yeah, Miyatano is five hundred. So about twenty-two cent. Yep, roughly that. So this whole meal cost about how much? How much is one of these dollars? I forget. Hmm. Then it went up a little bit. So we get a couple we get a couple of these mm -hmm. when we come home sometime. So it's about uh since we got of kumi and salad there all together it's like if that told me a thumbnail. So three thousand five hundred, which is roughly like dollar eighty. Yeah. Dollar eighty five US. So all this for a dollar eighty US. Mm-hmm. Roughly. And this was lunch. This was lunch today. And also something else, the way that we like I mean we trying I'm filming, so we're trying to do it for the camera. Mm -hmm. But Tanzanian culture and we've grown so accustomed to it. Rarely do we have like two plates. Right, we always share. When we eat, we just share. We eat off, off of one plate. I think we were Tanzanian, but we just didn't know it. Because we always would pretty much. <laughs> always do eat. that? Yep. We yeah. We'd fix a big plate and just eat together. Because it's just me and you. Mm -hmm. So we would always kind of do that. So we just. And that's kind of like our time together to, you know, eat. And yeah. From the day. So. Right. So, yeah. Is this dishes really? to wash? Yep. This dishes, dishes to wash. And we really appreciate all y'all, our members, our subscribers. Mm hmm We appreciate all y'all. Yup. Tay Eats went and got the cheese cone and ate it for us. Mm, yes, she did. So, you know, we're not mukbang. Muk, I can't say mukbang channel. <laughs> I just say mukbang. Mukbang. Yeah. But we wanted to do this for our peeps because uh, yeah, yeah. some of my members did say, hey, I would like to see this. I would like to see that. And just to show y'all the food and how we eat it. With our hands. With our hands. With our clean. With our clean hands. Washed hands. Give me a little bit more of that tomato sauce, girl. Sure, baby. Get them chips. I don't know if we're going to finish this. I'm trying to help you, but. I might. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look hungry, y'all. Yep. And as much as y'all see us eat goat and, and talk about meat, because, I mean, I spend a lot of time still learning and and uh, have a deep interest in butchering and um, the Tanzanian way of preserving meat. Most stuff is fresh, so butchering is a big deal because um, refrigerators are not everywhere. Right. You have like cool houses, the construction of these uh, um, butchers uh, really designed to be washed easy, clean easy, mm -hmm. sterilized easy. Mm -hmm. uh, the style keeps it cool. Right. And um, they get fresh animal every morning. And so you talk about a, a just in time system, it, it, that's how it is here too. Mm -hmm. But the only difference is, it's just in time and just enough. Right. But instead of having to wait for something to come off of a truck from 150, 200 miles away, you just walk over to somebody's house or down the road and grab you another goat <laughs> or another cow. Right. And you, yeah. And you work on them. And because in some cases, the process can be so fresh, y'all, real talk, that if they say they do run out of, out of meat or something like this, this animal... Probably got that business yesterday. Mm -hmm. 
More or, or earlier today, but I'm going to say yesterday. And mm -hmm. if they completely run out, one or two things happen. Either they don't get more for that day and just tell people they out. They out, mm hmm Which is very common. Yep. Or if they feel, if it's a Friday or Saturday or something and more people going to be out. They might send for some more. They'll send for mm -hmm. some more. Mm -hmm. Which may require a whole nother animal to be, to catch that work right. that day. Right. And <clears throat> so, yeah, just in time, <clears throat> systems can be effective. Absolutely. And for y'all that wonder what it tastes like, it's, it's beef. So... They cook it over open grill, mm -hmm. and you know it's a little smoky. A little smoky. Uh, what's that season? Um, like masala. Masala. Mm hmm. Um, kind of savory, and it really hit with the. Uh, you would never think, because back home. All the bell pepper we eat is usually in dressing or it's in some salad or something. Yeah, it's like cooked in something. It's cooked in yeah. something, but y'all. The way that fresh bell pepper changes the taste of stuff and complements stuff. It's so good. Y'all, yeah. I'm telling you, it's something else. Yeah, but super fresh, super delicious, over an open flame. Um, it's tender. Mm hmm. Um, you might have to add a little seasoning, you know, a little salt. Yeah, pepper, to your taste. You know. To your taste, you know. Oh, uh, yeah. So, y'all, I think. Because I, I don't want y'all to see us wiping the pan now. But we will. <laughs> <laughs> but now, this is for all our moot mongers, all our subscribers, all our members. We appreciate y'all for real. Um, we just want to do this for y'all so y'all can see the food while we eating it. While we eating it, y'all. Because we're hungry. It's lunchtime. And y'all make sure y'all check out Friday Faves. Y'all make yes. sure y'all check out Trill Tuesday. Yup, yup. We appreciate y'all. And until next time, you know what we're going to be doing. What we're going to be doing, baby? Being country in, in another country. country. Peace. Peace. Well, how?